Now we go out and out with Jiminy Glick. I am so excited today, and if I had if I had bells on, I'd start ringing them like the wonderful Lisa Minnelli. But I don't have bells, so I shan't. For I'm sitting here with my absolute hero, a man who I've admired for years and years, a good three years now, the fabulous and often misunderstood Regis Philbin. Regis Philbin, how are you? I'm fine, Jiminy. Nice Aren't to be with you. Isn't it wonderful to see you in person and know that you are the man who saved ABC? That's right, Jiminy. Single-handedly in <laughs> Absolutely <laughs> right. <laughs> you have so many names, and, I, and they're so filled with Catholicism, everyone. Regis Francis Xavier Philbin. That's right. And I'm going to assume that's Latvian. No, no, no. It's Second guess. Bulgarian. Right. No. What would it be, Regis? Irish. So there's alcoholism in your family. <laughs> no, is that what no. you're saying? No, no. No, 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 no. Not at all. You started off as a page at NBC. That's right, yeah. Who was working at NBC when you started on page in 1955? Well, my first show was the Steve Allen Dyke Show. So who was working on the show? It was the greatest collection of an ensemble cast ever developed on television. Who were they? Steve and Edie. Steve Bill and Edie. <laughs> Steve Lawrence and Edie Gourmet. Steve Lawrence! And Edie Gourmet! When? Uh, for the Steve Allen Show. You worked on the Steve Allen Show. I didn't know that. Well, I was a page. Of Steve you were a page! <laughs> why, Stacey, why wasn't I told that Regis Philbin was a page? And where were you a page? Uh, at the Steve Allen Show. The Steve Allen Show. On NBC show. here in New York City. Who was on that show? Actually, it was the Tonight Show, Jiminy. The Tonight Show? Yeah, the Tonight Show. I'm very confused. Well, we called it the Steve Allen Show, but it was really the Tonight Show. Who'd with you work Steve with on Allen. that show? Steve and Edie. Steve and Edie, I love them. <laughs> I think they're wonderful. You hosted a show from 51 to 64 in San Diego, California. Yeah, my first time on television, right. That was in 61 to 64. You yes. hosted a cheap. What was that called? The Regis Philbin Show. I. Oh, no other name we could think of. And off it went, off you went. And then before you know it, it's the Joey Bishop Show on ABC! And there's me just fell. There I am. And there you are. Yeah. And you walk off the show in protest, and everyone's stunned. Well, ABC didn't think I was the right guy for Joey, and I thought, well, maybe they're right. And one night, I just, like, like a fool, uh, said goodbye to Joey. And, and you walk off. And I walk off. And you, where do you walk? You uh, walk to the car. Yeah, to the car. And you turn on the car. Yes. And then I bet you get them malted. That's what I tend to do. Well, it was a lonely night for me. I, I bet it was a lonely night. I wondered if I had done the right thing. Had you? I think I guess I proved the point. I did come back. And you did come back. All was, well, it was forgiven. All was forgiven. And isn't that ironic, Regis Felben, that it was on ABC and to this day you're on CBS. Think about it. Who are your idols as a kid? Well, I loved Martin and Lewis. <laughs> Martin and Lewis? Yeah. Ooh, Sherry Lewis. No, no, no. And Deep. Ross Martin no, from no, Wild no, Wild no, West. I not... love them. I love them because he was, you never knew where they were going to go. You did get smart. Were you any good on it? I just played a cook. As a matter of fact, they had a little... To this day, people talk about the, the, the uh, scene where Don Adams uh, played a little practical joke on me. Who's Don Adams? He was the agent in Get Smart. What's Get Smart? Get Smart is the name of God Don Adams' show. <laughs> oh, I'd love to see it. Go on. Well... I was playing a baker, and everybody was suspicious of a everybody. A baker, a baker of pies. And a baker bread. of pies and, and cake. Yes. yes. And uh, he set cake. me up, and then he hit me in the face with a cream pie. Who did? Don Adams. He wasn't Edie Adams' sister, was he? No, 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 no. So... Edie Adams was married to Ernie Kovacs. I miss Ernie Kovacs. So do I. So do we all. We don't hear from him so much. It seems like he was so popular, then he just... Switch to William Morris or something, and you don't hear from him anymore. Yeah, he. Why do people Unfortunately, do that? it was killed in an accident. The car. No, no, don't tell me this, Stacy. Why was not told that Ernie Kovacs is gone? When I'm not told things like, then suddenly I look bad, and I look the fool of a Regis Xavier well, or who got Philbin or whatever the hell his name is. Kathy Lee. Yes, Which Kathy. Which one do you like better, Kathy Lee or Kelly? Well, I, I really like them both. I spent 15 years with Kathy Lee, and I like uh, uh, any eight sexual tension. Between you and Kelly, Kelly Lee. No, 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 no. Kathy Lee, no. There was, there's never been any sexual attention. Sexual attention. No, no, no. So you, you would do the show. Yes. For an hour. Right. And then, and then, and then would you ever, and then, and, and then, then. we would kind of go our separate. Go your separate ways. And so you and Kelly Ripper. Same thing. Same thing. Yeah, do the show. Do you think they'd get in a big back to each other? They might. You they know, might. they really might. Oh, that'd be fun to see. I'd love to see that. You were in Dudley Do Right and you played yourself. Yes, yes, Kathy Lee and I were in Dudley Do-Right. Kathy Lee, why don't you get to do a film with Kelly Ripa? 
I don't know. We haven't uh, had any offers yet. Oh, I think you'd be wonderful, wonderful. Because I think you're wonderful. Well, I... And I think America loves you. I don't think you knew how much America loves you. And I think that when I think of, when I think of wisdom, and I think of someone who makes people smile every second of the day, I think of a man named Regis Xavier Cougar. Oh! Are you all right, Jiminy? I don't know. How did well, that... Let me help you. How did that happen? Regis. Let me help you. Okay. Thank you. No. Where did, where did the helmet open? Oh, I'm right Where's behind you. Oh, my He's old. Oh, my God. I never had an interview like that on my life. <laughs>